It's a nerd alert right now. Uh, Apple's new iPad officially in stores tomorrow. We've got our own resident nerd here. Mm -hmm. uh, Clayton Morris already right. has his mitt on one. Yeah, I've been testing it out for the past week. This thing is amazing. I figured out what I'd do is I'd show you a speed test first. Okay. All right. So Steve is holding the iPad 2. That's Excited. last year's model. This is mine here. This is the brand new iPad. Steve and I are both going to hit the SciTech page on the FoxNews.com channel at the same time and see how quickly mine loads. Ready? Three, one, two, one. Tap. All right, so we're both loading here. Look how, how quickly. Wow, you're right. You do beat him by a millisecond. Oh. Wow. <laughs> Think about everything you can, you can do your laundry in the meantime. Uh, actually, I mean, it depends on where you are. This is running LTE speeds now, so it's super fast. And obviously, the big, the big buzz is all about the screen. Text on this thing is absolutely incredible. Just to give you a frame of reference, if you're watching Fox News at home right now on like a high definition television, right. this screen has 3.1 million pixels. That's about four times as many as your screen at home does. Pixel right mania. Now. So you, you think Allison? <laughs> looks, you think Allison Allison looks crisp and clear at home yeah. right now. Yeah. Imagine her on Oh, great. IPad. More HD TV. So That's much... what I need. <laughs> <laughs> you know what this is going to do then? If, if this is going to be such a great device for watching stuff, right. people are going to start watching, downloading Hulu things and Netflix and watching it on the iPad. Yeah, and you know, Fox News just rolled out their brand new Fox News app for the mm -hmm. iPad, and actually you can stream Fox and Friends right on your iPad now. Live? Right? Live. Live on the web right now on your iPad, so you don't need right. to Right, and, and that's of course the beach scene we have on our show. This is exact. This is iPhoto. They rolled this out. There's my son Miles. The, the photos video. are crisp and clear, and it feels like you're holding like a 12 inch, uh, a 12 inch glossy print in your hand. Uh, the speed is amazing. The crispness of the screen is is incredible, and the fact that the battery life is the same as the older iPad, and it's the same price, four ninety nine. Mm -hmm. It's really remarkable. And uh, if you saw if you saw Apple stock price yesterday, nearing six hundred. Wow. Dollars a share. Well, now, so Clayton, you won't be needing your iPad 2 anymore. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's oh, fantastic. Hey, Clayton, what was the buzz? matches your white wedding dress. What was the buzz of the announcement? Did it live up to the hype? I mean, for the insiders that know this, like you? Alice and, and, and journalists were sitting in the audience at this event saying, how in the world did they manage to get that screen? The, the cost involved in getting this new Retina display is, must be incredible for them, and the technology involved, taking what they had on the iPhone 4S and putting it in the iPad. I mean, they own the production line. So you're going to see all these... Uh, you're going to see all these other tablets come out this year that are just now getting up to snuff with the first generation iPad. Right. And they own the market. And, they own and the Glenn, market. Did, this was in the pipeline before uh, Steve Jobs died. So are you, is everybody still wondering, is the creativity still going to be there? I think it is. And you, know, you see some of these product teams that work at Apple, they're really like excited about what they're doing over the next few years. And I know some of those guys, they're doing some great work out there. So. I think their main designer, that Ivy guy, went to the state dinner last night at the White House. Yeah, he's, he's heralded. I think he just was knighted, actually. Mm -hmm. England, by the right. way. Yeah. I so think it's an eye night. All right. So they go on sale tomorrow at 8 a.m. How much? Uh, $4.99. Which is about the same as the old ones, right? The exact same as the old ones. And my full review is up on foxnews.com on the SciTech page. Allison? What? Give me that. What's what? Give what? Me that. <laughs> don't, don't put it on the ledge. Look at him. Put it on the ledge.